This morning, we can say that the FBI's investigations are politically tainted. Fox News has obtained texts sent between Peter Strzok and Lisa Page, both FBI agents. Strzok played a key role in the Clinton email probe and the Russia, Russia, Russia investigation. These texts sent right before the election last year show extreme political bias, personal animosity and, most importantly, a willingness to shape the investigation to protect Hillary. Here we go. March 4th, 2016, Lisa Page says, God, Trump is loathsome human. Strzok says, yet he may win. Later that same day, Strzok says, God, Hillary should win 100 million to zero. Page says, I know. March 16th, Page, I cannot believe Donald Trump is likely to be an actual, serious candidate for president. All right. Fast forward to August the 6th, and here's where the two appear to be okay with protecting actively Hillary Clinton. Page says this, and maybe you're meant to stay where you are. That will be inside the investigation, because you're meant to protect the country from that menace. Strzok says, thanks. It's absolutely true that we're both very fortunate. And of course, I'll try and approach it that way. I just know it will be tough times. I can protect our country at many levels. Not sure if that helps. August the 26th, 2016, Strzok says, just went to a Southern Virginia Walmart. I could smell the Trump support. Page says, yep, out to lunch with name redacted. We both, have, we both hate everyone and everything. Just riffing on the hot mess that is our country. Strzok says, yeah. Is scary real down here. All right. October the 20th, 19 days before the election. Strzok says, I am riled up. Trump is an effing idiot. Is unable to answer a coherent, uh, offer a coherent answer. There you have it. Strzok was present at Hillary's FBI interview. And he questioned Huma Abedin and Cheryl Mills. Later, he questioned General, General Flynn. These texts are the reason he was later removed from the Russia investigation. The point here is that any investigation of politicians must be objective. Who did what? Further, it must be seen to be without political bias. That is not the case here. A key figure, Peter Strzok, shows extreme bias and shows his willingness to use it to protect Hillary Clinton and attack Donald Trump. The investigation is tainted.